Hello, Chris Brazier. I wanted to visit with you about how to safely bring food uh, and other things into your house so that you don't uh, get infected with COVID-19 uh, or get the person you're caring for uh, with a traumatic brain injury infected with COVID-19. And the first thing that I did to figure out uh, what, you know, what to do safely is I went and I found out how long the virus can last on certain surfaces. And I printed out something here uh, that I hope helps. And basically it says, this is according to the uh, John, Johns Hopkins University, that on plastic, the virus can live up to 72 hours or three days. Uh, for stainless steel, uh, whatever that may be, it's for 48 hours or two days. On cardboard, it can live up to 24 hours or one day, and I don't know why, but they included copper, uh, can live on there for uh, four hours. And I don't know, not many people are gonna be bringing copper into the house. But anyway, so that gives you an idea of the length of time. Second thing is important to know what this Johns Hopkins study said is that uh, while the virus may live on the surface, um, it's, it gets uh, more and more of it dies as time goes by. But anyway, here's what we've decided to do, like in my house and for my loved one that we're caring for. Uh, first, is anytime we get uh, stuff from the grocery store or the mail or anything like that, if we have to bring it in uh, right away, we'll usually have a, like a place outside where we can like uh, clean the exterior or take the item out uh, while uh, after after the surfaces have been cleaned, um, like in mail, uh, stuff like that. But like for groceries, uh, just what we're doing is um, having a place uh, to put them for three days. I mean, assuming it's not milk or anything, uh, stuff that won't spoil, I'm just letting it sit there for three days. And um, after that, I'll bring it into the house uh, if it has to come in faster, if it's like produce, I'll just wash it off. Uh, that's what I think, that's what I read the CDC recommends to do. And um, if it's something else that can't really be washed off, like, I mean, you can't spray Clorox on produce or anything like that. If it's something else that needs to come in, what we're doing is we're leaving the packaging outside, uh, cleaning uh, the surface of whatever we bring in. And um, that's how we're doing it. And we're putting it in a safe uh, or a sanitized place, you know, once it gets into the house. So anyway, I hope that helps. I know that seems like a lot, but I just thought I'd share um, what we're doing. And um, I've done, I, you know, I looked at a few different uh, doctors, uh, cause I'm not a doctor, uh, to figure out what they recommend. And this is what we've uh, come up with. So uh, if you have a better, uh, if you feel like you've got a better, um, process, please share with the group. I uh, hope it helps. If you have any questions, feel free to message me or anybody else on the, on the group. I hope everybody's staying safe. Thanks.